Praise be Jesus Christ! Today, we celebrate the glorious moment when our Lord ascends to heaven. The day the disciples were commissioned by our Lord to go out to the whole world and proclaim the good news. With this reason, our Mother Church also celebrates the World Communications Day. With this year's theme, Life Becomes History, which is based on the book of Exodus that says that you may tell your children and grandchildren. Sa aking mga kamanggagawa sa Social Communications Ministry, ikalimumput apat na Communications Sunday na. At dahil dito, Muli tayong inaanyayahan at hinahamo ng ating mahal na Santo Papa sa pamamagitan ng kanyang mensahe sa ating lahat ngayon na pinamata, pinamagatang Life Becomes History. At dahil dito, hinahamo niya tayo at inaanyayahan na muling bumalik sa isa sa mga pangunahing katangian ng salita ng Diyos. Tato yun, ang pagkukwento, storytelling. At dahil dito, siyempre ang nagiging tanong, anong dapat ikwento? Siyempre ang unang kwento, is the story of stories. Ang tawag ko po nga dyan ay the greatest love story ever told. Ang kwento na nilalaman ng salita ng Diyos tungkol sa pag-ibig ng Diyos para sa ating mga tao. Ito ang kwentong hindi nauubusan ng mensahe para sa tao. At ito ang kwento natin dapat isagawa sapagkat ito'y kwento rin natin hanggang ngayon sa pangkasalukuyan. Kwento ng mga karanasan ng mga Kristiyano. Kwento na nagbibigay sa ating lahat ng mensahe na patuloy tayong minamahal ng Diyos. At dahil dito, tayo inaanyayahan ng Santo Papang isagawa muli ang pagkukwentong ito. Kwento na nagpapanibago para sa ating lahat ang katotohanan ng karanasan ng kung gaano tayong kahalaga sa ating Diyos. At ito po ay isang kwentong kailangan nating isagawa, tayo lalo't higit mga nasa social communication ministries sapagkat hindi natin may tatanggi sa panahong ito, katulad din ng binanggit na Santo Papa, meron din pong mga kwentong hindi magaganda, mga kwentong hindi mabubuti. At sa ganitong katotohanan, ang kwento po na napakaganda ng kwento ng Diyos, ang kwento ng ating karanasan ng Diyos, ang kwento ng karanasan ng mga mananampalataya sa panahong ito, patungkol sa pag-ibig ng Diyos, ay siyang ating dapat ikwento bilang storytellers ng simbahan. Kaya nga, tayong mga lingkod, mga kamanggagawa ko sa social ministries, be the storytellers of God, be the storytellers of the story of the love of God. At sa panahon natin ito ngayon, nawa, sama-sama nating lalong maipakalat ang kwento ng pag-ibig ng Diyos. At sa inyong lahat, lagi, always be blessed and be a blessing. We thank Bishop Jenny for a piece of his life's heartwarming story. We also thank all those who have shared significant stories of their life, such as Troy Clara and Thor Escartin, Assistant Nurse Leonila Quison de Guzman, Father Ulysses Navarro, Society of St. Paul, Sister Evangelina Kanag, Daughters of St. Paul, Father Michael LaGuardia, a Salesian priest. Father Rollin Jean Marie Flores, Society of St. Paul. Miss Daisy Santos. Chelsea Bringhera. And Most Reverend Milo Hubert Vergara. I believe that they all had added inspirational fibers as God weaves beautiful and colorful tapestry of life. On the past nine days of, as a preparation for this day's church celebration, the World Communications Day. Let us pray. God our Father, creator of every wonder, we praise and thank you for our ability to communicate and to choose the right words and gestures to bring hope and love. 
We are grateful that you have enlightened the human mind to discover the media of social communication, such as television, movies, radio, print, internet, and the constantly developing social media. We pray for all those who work in the field of communication and the experts in cyberspace and information technology, that they may convey everything that is good, beautiful, and true, so as to open opportunities for building communion with one another. May all of us and all movie patrons, televiewers, readers, social media users, and music streaming subscribers receive with a critical sense the messages that are transmitted to us and that our lives may become a living communication of the love of Christ. May young people listen to God's call to dedicate their lives to this multimedia apostolate and may the people of goodwill be inspired to contribute with prayer, action, and offerings, so that through this means, the Church may preach the Gospel to all peoples. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. <music>